Hello, rare and precious gems. The campaign is over, the votes have been counted, and you're now in denial. So it's time to let it all out with this week's brand new flow. ALP Yoga. Okay, we're going to start by warming up our left and right factions. So feel that internal tension as the antiquated power structure holds you back from progress. And now let's move into our first position, firing our internal pollsters. So just feel a false sense of security flowing through your body as your paid staff members assure you you've got this in the bag. Remember to breathe. And from here we're going to move into our Adani position. So feel the north half of your body fully supporting while the southern half runs away. Straddle both positions now. Really confuse your core electorate. It's okay. If you don't like this position, just don't vote for it. Okay, instantly regret saying that now as we move from our unlosable election straight into the, oh my God, we lost the election. Feel the burn. Now we're gonna flow into our next phase, the blame game. So just center yourself and start pointing fingers. I knew Shorten was never popular. We should have grandfathered franking credits and it was all Queensland's fault. And once you've removed all self-awareness, it's time to rediscover the real you. What do you stand for? So in three, two, one, we're going to panic and start shedding our policies. So just letting go of fraking credits, negative gearing, breathe it all out. <sighs> Hasten slowly. And now we're going to move into our party leadership ballot, also known as the plebiscite or Chalmers. So really put your hand up for this. Stretch your ambition. You want this. And now realise you don't have the numbers, so claim that you want to spend more time with your young family, which moves into our shortened dilemma. So just trying to find him a position on your front bench, but be careful as this can transition into the sleeping dragon. And from here we'll move into our Ed Husick, falling on our sword, then straight into the Keneally parachute. This is a tricky move where a strong male candidate volunteers his position to an incoming female member, like so. And bowing to your factions. Then once you're feeling nice and empowered, let's return to our party leadership ballot. So realigning yourself with your party's progressive egalitarian values. Now go ahead and elect a middle-aged white man who's been in politics his whole life. And as his deputy, another middle-aged white man who's also been in politics his whole life. Now let's end with our favourite ALP move. Remaining in opposition for the foreseeable future. Namaste.